hello and uh, welcome to my channel where today we'll be playing some more uh, Train Sim World uh, 2. Uh, so uh, welcome back. What I've been playing the last, uh, uh, the other day, uh, for those that are, 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 are revisiting, I played, um, I realised I bought this Isle of Wight uh, expansion last year and I hadn't even played <laughs> Bought it last August and it's now July, so I hadn't even played it. So I decided I've got a few other expansions I bought, so I bought them in the sale because they were cheap, and then just not go around to playing them. So I thought I'd give it, uh, uh, I'd play that. We did the introduction the other day, and today I'm going to do a run because it is July. I will pick July. I'm gonna let's have some wetness and some rain and some cloud level, oh, just to mix it up a little bit and then we'll choose a run and what i'm going to do is do a run from from one end of the uh of the island there. Look at this this nice early in the morning shanklin to let's do this okay 8 18 in july let's try this so we'll get started and then we'll do the, the proper welcomes uh, of course i've got to remember how to do everything master key on and then you've got to put the lever on i remember that then the reverser key in and forward one okay a uh, break is release there we go unlock the doors should have done that first oh no let's apply a bit of break <laughs> poor people i was rolling back and i couldn't um we've got a minute I'll, I'll go and get that so let's go back in let's get up as I said, I've only done the uh, training missions. It won't let me through there. Let's go the long way around. Hello. Sorry. 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 Excuse me. Oh, no. It won't let me out at all. No. Okay. We'll, we'll leave that for another day. Sit down. Get in the seat. Okay. The main thing is to see the trains. So the rain does sound absolutely fantastic. So we have to wait a few minutes and then we can get on the route. So I haven't uh, done this station yet. I haven't been to this end of the line. So this is the first time I've been here. Um, let's get started. Let's get moving and then we can sort of do a proper chat. Look at these people in t-shirts in the rain. Let's close the doors. No, no beeping on these. Uh, release the brake. Apply some power and we are off. Fantastic. Okay, so welcome to my channel. Um, it's nice to see you. If you are a returning visitor, uh, let's just come off that a little bit. Ooh, come on. If you're a returning visitor, it's uh, lovely to see you again. It's always great to see a familiar face. If you are a new visitor, you are, of course, equally welcome to my channel. Um, it's, it's, it's nice to see uh, new faces here. Uh, uh, please leave the place tidy. Oh, they do work, the instrument lights. They didn't work the other day on the, the training mission. Um, and for those that are new, it's, it's just me. I chill out. I play games. I'm not necessarily the best at games, but I just... Uh, uh, enjoy myself playing them so that's what I tend to do well I tell you what I do need to do well, we need to do this because I don't like um, let's do that hold on uh, settings objective marker off don't like seeing that floating distance marker yeah it's just me I, I, I'm an older gentleman with time on my hands I've always enjoyed playing video games and that's all I do and I I tend to talk about you know what I'm doing as I as I do it. Uh, so so it's nice to see you. Uh, uh, we been playing uh, mostly this and Sudoku on the Nintendo Switch, and that's all I've been playing really um, so far. But the idea is to play a, a variety of games. Well, just had a bit of break there because look, we're going down the slope on the bottom right hand side next to the. Um, speed that shows there's quite a steep slope we're going down and oh no and we're going into the station so let's jump back in I'll tell you the other thing I haven't done is I haven't turned the lights on the train lights and I do headlight on there we go oh no 
That's a bit too much brake. <laughs> I'm a bit keen, me. I'm a bit keen on the brakes, which is better than sort of forgetting to stop completely, which I've certainly done in the past. But, you know, as with all these, and if you're new to the train sim world, each there are different routes, different trains, and it's getting used to the feel of each train and the brakes to, to, to stop at you know, the right time. And, and, uh, and as I said, it's only the second time I've played this train, so it will take a little bit of getting used to. Now, the first thing I've noticed about this line is there's only one track. So we're definitely not going to see any trains passing us. A little bit late already, unfortunately. Apply that brake. Open the doors. Yeah, I'm already late. That's terrible, isn't it? So the top left, again, for those that are new, the very top left, there's the time, 8.22 and 43 seconds. Or, uh, and underneath is the time I need to close the doors. That's when I need to be closing the doors. So that's in the past now. <laughs> that's 20 seconds ago. But I can't close the doors until that yellow bar is filled up. So you can see I'm here a little bit late. So release the brake and away we go. So now if you look up to the top left, it, it says... The time currently is 8.23 and 10, 11, 12 seconds, and I have to get to the next station by 8.25. And it's uh, just next to that, it says stop at location Sandown Platform 1, and it's 0.7 of a mile away. But really, it's really about having a look around this um, expansion, this downloadable route, if you will, the train sim world. Oh, caravan. Sure, why point it out? <laughs> to be honest, I like to look around the town. So yes, yeah, so it's nice to see everyone. I, you know, I, I, I've um, I picked up this game as I said earlier last year in a sale, and um, I love the sound of the train. I picked up this in a sale last year. The lights come on. Yes, they did. To be at 15 miles an hour. In the, give it a bit of break. Give it a bit so that normal is quite a powerful break. Even the hold. Uh, it looks like this hold minimum normal, and then I'm guessing that. Make sure I've dropped down for this 15 mile an hour board there. But I knew it was coming because up in the top right, just under that picture of the red uh, stoplight, you'll see the red on the top right of the screen. It tells me what speed I need to be at what time. So in 300 yards, the speed limit will go back up to 45. I imagine it's slow down for this station. And this station obviously looks like a crossover station because we've split to two lines here. So if we are going to see some other train action, we might see it here. This seems very slow coming in here. There's another one of those boards, but I won't do the boards today. There's one of them cameras, you have to take pictures. I can't remember what the... Bad. I'm getting a little bit hang of it, but that was quite easy to stop on time, I suppose. So that was a bit weird, I couldn't get out of the, the cab, it's a bit of a worry. Um, but that door won't open. Brilliant. Done the camera, there you go, look at me, cameraing it all up. So there seems to be a few little. Um, bits and pieces that could do with them um, looking at. But it's quite an old uh, add-on now, so whether they would still look at it or not, we don't want to uncouple. We'd leave people behind, wouldn't we, Cold Star? I did look at these the other day, but being me, I forgot. Cab lights, with the cab light on, there we go. That's nice. Oh, speeding, look at that. 
speeding already, not concentrating. Oh, we're okay now. We'll get the hang of this route. I'm just trying to get the hang of the train, I suppose, first. I did notice that the, uh, the lights are, don't seem to be on inside the, the carriages. That rain is good, isn't it? But it's quite heavy. It's quite heavy rain. No, maybe there's just no lights in the carriages. Um, so yeah, I, you know, I bought this. Didn't get around to playing it. I, was, I picked up um, two new routes just last week, a brand new dovetail routes that came out just you know earlier this year, and they were reduced. I was going to play them. I thought, look, I haven't played some of these older routes, so I'll play these first and have a look. And that way, you know, the, the idea being, if you're a train sim world two fan, you can look at this see if it's something from you. Judging by the, um, try to speed there a little bit. Judging by the, the fact that this run for this route is 26 minutes estimated time. I mean, they haven't, they haven't taken into account my, my driving yet. And it's one end of the line to the other. I think that already gives you a little bit of, um, a bit of information about how big the route is because you know, some of the other routes, you know, one end to the other will take you an hour, you know, of real-time play. So it's not, maybe not quite the biggest of routes. The sun is still trying to sign, but there are some dark rain clouds in the sky. So, uh, for a change, uh, and, I, and I've been talking about uh, Bones, my cat, who usually sits with me playing games, and, and I've been saying, you know, it's... In the summer months, I don't really see him as much, only at dinner time, <laughs> like all cats. But he is with me today, sitting up here with me. Uh, you know, he's not really paying much attention. He's just, he's just sort of fast asleep, really. But he, he keeps me company, and that's, that's nice. So I'm going to apply a bit more power here. I'm starting to lose a bit of speed. Cause, so so the, what I've noticed as well on this route already, there's a little bit of incline and decline. Come off that now. 500 yards. Top right is telling me 500 now. Nearly 400 yards. I've got to be 20 miles an hour. So I'm going to apply the brakes just a little bit. So I don't overspeed when I hit the location. We've got 200 yards till we actually come to a stop. So actually I'll apply a bit more brake. We're going to be late at this station as well. We'll check what score we got in a second for the last station. I know we were late. Okay, we're a little bit late again, so let's have a little, just a little walk around the platform. Oh, sorry, sorry, oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, so this is one of the collectibles, the ice cream, so let's do that. Not sure what that is, nothing. I don't know what the other collectible is. Have a look up in the look. Is that the other collectible down there? Oh, I've got to get back. I've got to get back. Yes, I've added a ticket. Let's jump down. Don't uh, don't do that, people. <laughs> Let's close that door. Release the brake, and off we go. We picked up another collectible. So the collectibles on this route is the cameras, the train maps. Which is kind of all routes the train maps. So we've got to be looking, don't go above 20 miles an hour here because there's our 20 mile an hour sign. Um, the ice creams, the cameras, and then these collectible tickets. So we'll um, keep a look out for those. Look, we've got a nice long run now to the next station. So let's um, sit for a 20. So let's come off the power. Right, let's look what I've got. So I'm getting 499 at that station for loading the passengers. I've got 500 at the other one. But so even though I'm a little bit late, I'm still doing a good score. My stopping isn't bad either. Four, so 500 is the maximum score. So for that last station, I scored 494 for stopping accuracy. So that's, you know, out of 500, that's, that's not bad at all. So actually, I'm doing all right for score, really. Um, let's get a bit of power. Oh, no, let's get a bit of power on. Get rid of that, okay. And let's have a look outside. There's a lot of countryside, oh, there's some houses there. The rain sounds fantastic, the sound of the rain and the sound of the trains. Those who are regulars to my channel know how much I love the sound of trains. 
growing up in North London, uh, very close to the underground mine. Um, I used to hear it every night. And those goals are the wrong way around. Must be from late five a side or practice or something. We've got some uh, sheep. Yeah, so this route is, is uh, designed and it was created by, uh, not by Dovetail Games, who are the makers of the trade symbol. It was uh, made by Rivet Games, who are like a, a separate company. I mean, I, I, I presume they have some sort of uh, QA process they go through with Dovetail Games, they just can't release anything they like. Um, we have no time for the next station. So it's made by them, uh, and then they sell it uh, to work with this game. So then you can buy this. Now this was priced at twenty pounds, and as I said in my video the other day, I think I paid uh, twelve pounds or eleven ninety nine. And I, um, you know, it, it seems okay. It does seem a little smaller, a little light on detail. When I, when I think we, I was just playing. Um, uh, Dresden and London Commuter, because I picked up the rush hour routes and Boston, of course. They see a lot more detail, but you know it's a different kind of route. And, and let's face it, you know, the Isle of Wight is hardly going to compare to London or Boston, you know, for, for busyness and stuff like that. I do like these telephone uh, um, wires, telephone lines. Everyone used to have a telephone in their home. And, and I remember my phone being in the front room. There's a lot of people's phones in the front room. So, so I mean, you wouldn't really understand this if you, if you know, you're born in the last 30 years, maybe. But um, my phone, phone would be in the front room, so I'd have to, um, you know, if I wanted to phone and speak to you know, a girl or, or something. I'd be, I'd be standing there <laughs> trying, to, trying, to, trying, to, trying to talk to this girl. And my mum and dad would be sitting there watching Coronation Street or Everdale or something. <laughs> Beyond me. And, and there was no texting, of course, in those days. That was it. So if I said to her, look, I, I'll meet you three o'clock Friday or whatever, um, that was it. I couldn't then text her an hour later. No, sorry, I meant... I mean, two o'clock or, or five o'clock or something. That you were kind of, you'd have to phone her back up again, and, and you know she'd be sitting there in front of her mum and dad, and you know. <laughs> oh dearie me, dearie me! It's, it's funny to think back of. Um, we need to look at like speed here. You oh, can hear the brakes cut in. That's good. Probably applied a bit too hard. I panicked a little bit there. I saw it coming up quite fast, and I think I panicked. So I, but, but we were right. We're going down the slope. I've released the brake. I'm now just sort of free wheeling. Oh, I oh know. I was going via location. I wasn't supposed to stop. I didn't read. So when it says go via or via location. The idea is to just drive through that point. Not, not, not that you can steer anywhere in the train. I think I'll go, I think I'll go left today. Um, but I didn't read that correctly. So I was slowing down unnecessarily. Uh, Alright, so now we have a, a stop. Stop at location. They should ride St. John's Road platform. So there you go. So we actually have a stop to go to now. Now that is, um, that was where I did the training. I know there's a fair bit after that. Oh no, it's not, because we've done, we've started down here and come all the way up to here. And you can see the star where I'm going. I'm just keep out my speed. Oh, that does feel quite short, actually. Yeah, then it's the, uh, the here. oh, that is, um, that does feel, you know, short. What's that, six? We went through one station, completely didn't stop. We were definitely at the end of the line when we started. So, that does seem quite uh, 
it's all, it, it does feel short, you know. We've started there, first station, second station, third station, fourth station, we've gone through a station, that's five, and then now we've got six, and then seven and eight, and that doesn't feel quite short. But, again, you know, sorry Isle of Wight, you're not big enough for me, it's not like I can put another landmass on the side just to keep me happy, it's, you know, it's the, it's, the name of the, it's the name of the game, you know, some routes are going to be, you know, maybe short but quite interesting, it's uh, well, a bit fast here, aren't I, let's do the max, let's see how it handles the late, oh, I still would be okay, I think I could apply the brake quite late, the brake does seem quite good. Oh, we've, we've gained a bit of time now, because uh, um, before, when I was looking at the time, the departure time, which is in this case 37.30 at the top of the left, um, I'd already gone past it, but this time I haven't. So, now we did look around this platform the other day, look, I did the map there, and I did the ice creams here, and the camera on the other side, there it is over there. So let's, um, let's get these doors closed. Release the brakes and away we go as well. Sorry, excuse me. Excuse me. Ooh, excuse me. So we're going to drop down to a 20 mile an hour limit now and 1.1 mile, we have a 15 mile an hour limit. It's quite a small train, isn't it? You know, compared to some of the trains, but you know. Again, part, part, part of the fun of this game, and we haven't seen another train pass us at all, but I notice now we've got two lines. Um, part of the, you know, the pleasure I get out of the game is playing lots of different trains. You know, every train can be a modern you know, train with a 100 mile or 100 kilometer route. Well, let's say hello to Shabbat tomorrow. We haven't said hello to him yet. We've got the light on today so we can see him. He looks like he's got oh, he's some bit of break, some bit of bad. It's like some bags under the eye. Shabbat Zamai, I think he might have been out last night. He does look more smarter today. I like the uniform for this route. He does look very, very smart. Is it down there? I think behind the brakes a little bit coming on. Yeah. So as I said, I thought I'd do two runs. I'll go th this way. Then what I'll do is I'll. Um, uh, uh, later on this week, I'll do another video. Oh, and again, just get in the cab for the tunnel just to see. Oh, no, no, too much brake. There's a lot of uh, on brake, off brake. We do actually have a time here. We're in a very dark tunnel here. Oh, there we go. Ooh, I saw, oh, I thought I saw a bit of light there. Light at the end of the tunnel. That's a worry. I saw light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> Oh, I hope I didn't. <laughs> um, so, um, let's give it a little bit more power. Um, and what I'll do is, later on this week, as I said, I'll, I'll do another run. So this is like in the morning, I'll do one in the afternoon. I think I'll do a, a one in the snow. I haven't done a snow run for a, for a long time, and I, and I do like the, the snow. So again, for those that aren't familiar with this game, you know, what you do, there's like a, what they call a journey mode, and you kind of play a bit of everything for that route. Different times of day, rain, sun, shine, some of this, some of that, early in the morning, late at night, you know, you kind of, kind of play that. And the idea being is then you can go in manually and select what route you want to do and choose the month and choose the weather and choose whether a long one or a short one. And then you can, and you kind of know what you like then after you've had a little, um, let's try and max this late. And this, oh, no, yeah, that break is very good. What's going up the hill, I suppose, so that will uh... I do like the break on this train. So, yeah, the idea being is you get a, you get a sense of what you like. I don't think I've done that camera yet. Should we try that? Let's get out of the chair. No, it doesn't like it. That door does not like it. Might be an auto lock on the door. If I... Did I do this camera the other day? Yes. Bah, humbug. Oh, that, that other... No, it's not. Was it? No, it's not. Oh yes, it is there. Ticket added. Okay. Um, so I'll do another run later on 
uh, this week and I'll do it like maybe this is early morning I'll go the other direction early evening um, which isn't early morning I suppose it's mid morning formal morning really um, I'll go the other way and we'll set it snowing or something and we'll, we'll get it like it's in November or something like that just to, so, so as I said you could choose the day so if you you know I, I love the early morning run to the snow you can set that for every route you know short runs long runs it's up to you so that's what i'll do i'll um, I, I must admit i do like this pier this is obviously the highlight of this route and i'm not sure how comfortable i'd be riding on a train on it so. i mean they've got cars driving up and down in there yeah so i'll do that later this week oh again with the speed i'll do that a little bit later this week i'll um, do another run or the other way so end to end the other way and um, you see how we get on with that and then and then uh, you know but then we'll move on we'll play something else and train sim world it's just like i said really to, to get down to 15 miles an hour before see at the start of the platform there you can see it there oh, I'll just jump to the cab you won't see it now you'll see it there look there's a 15 mile an hour sign just there you go Sounds good as well, the, the clunk clunk of the trains. And the, the clunk clunk, that's my technical way of describing it. Okay, let's get that some max. Let's let everyone out. Okay. But there you go, that, yes, I'll be honest, that, 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 that did feel short to me. That did feel short. It is a. Um, I mean, full price, it's cheaper than the other full price routes. And again, we can't, we can't blame Isla White for being the size it is. There's not much we can do about that. Um, but you weigh that into your decision-making process if you're interested in you know, this, buying this route. As I said, I picked it up in a sale. It was 40% off and, um, and then proceeded to not play it <laughs> for a year. Um, We'll do a, just have a little walk around the station here. We'll do that. Um, let's uh, uh, return to free row to get out of my seat. Now, can I get out of this door? Climb up still. It doesn't like that, does it? It really doesn't like getting you out there. So I can get out here. Oh. No. Oh. Let's um, work it out. Did I open the door? I did. Okay, let's go and have a little look around here. Yeah, you would have to make your own decision whether it's value for money for yourself or not. Um, like I said, I paid 11 or 12 pounds for it, something like that. Can we go in around here? We can. What's down here? It's a car park. Maybe he's driving around in circles. Some old bins there. Um, what is this? We've quite a lot of this end. Or what's this? Uh, oh, that's one of the uh, story missions. They call them scenarios. Get a bus somewhere? Can we get on the bus? No. Well, that'd be strange, wouldn't it? There's not really much up here. So people come off the train, get on the mini bus, and then uh, go look for one of those tickets. There it is. Get on the bus and go back. Yeah, that doesn't. That, that does feel quite. Strange. Oh, there you go. That, that, that was the idea. I'll do another. I'll do another video later this week and I'll go the other direction. Any tickets on that? Yes, there is. Um, I'll go the other direction and we'll, we'll set it snowing to get a different uh, vibe. Look at that. Oh, I quite like that. It's quite a nice view, isn't it? Oh, there's the ice cream thing as well. All right, well, thank you for watching. Uh, uh, um, I, I hope you enjoyed it. It's um, a little bit different and I, I'm going to do another one of these later this week. So if you didn't enjoy it, you're in for a boring time later this week. Um, but I do hope you enjoyed watching it. If you did like this video, uh, please consider uh, 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 leaving it a like down below. You know what to do. If you did enjoy watching this video, I'm sure you can find something on YouTube that you would enjoy. Um, uh, uh, if you like this kind of content, which is just sort of, there you go, see, look at me now, I'm on, a, I'm, on a, I'm on a roll now. If you do like this kind of content, oh, it is, look, it, it does kind of match the picture that you'd be looking at. 
If you do enjoy this sort of content, consider uh, subscribing to my channel and set your notifications and when I do uh, uh, more videos you'll get to know and get to watch them. I play this and I also play Sudoku on the Nintendo Switch. As I said before, I, I plan to play other games. I don't know what yet, I'm just playing these at the moment. You know, I play what I enjoy, you know, and, and if I'm currently enjoying these two games, that's what I'm going to play. And if I start enjoying something else, we'll, we'll stick that in. But if you have any suggestions of games you'd like to be played, then by all means, Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you're interested in seeing and we'll see what we can do. Well, thank you for watching. I do, I, I do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, um, it was lovely having you along for the uh, ride. Uh, we won't blame Isle of Wight for being smaller than all of Germany. Um, take care of yourselves, but most of all, take care of each other. Goodbye now.